How to train segmentation models on Coco in under 5 minutes. To do this, users must first download the data from Coco website. There are two methods to do this. One is to use wget. The disadvantage of this method is that you can only use the data on a single workspace. Thus, we recommend initiating the data as a one-panel dataset object which gives users unlimited access to the data even with multiple workspaces. You can also check and update data as you progress on your project. One-panel datasets are version controlled, meaning users can access previous data if necessary. You can learn more on docs.onepanel.io. Once the dataset is set up, you can jump in on your workspace and mount the data. Wait for workspace to launch and then open. Create new task and use mounted data. When satisfied with the settings, click Submit. You can check your data by clicking on Task Link. If you're having issues or errors, feel free to send us a message in Intercom. Our support is available 24-7. Next step, click Upload Annotations and select Coco option. Select .json file provided from Coco website and wait for the annotations to complete. Once done, check your data for any inconsistencies. On this next part is where one panel truly shines, as you can use this data to generate a segmentation model on your next pre-annotations, without the need to code in just a click of a button. Simply click on Create New Annotation Model, select Mask RCNN, and then Submit. Wait for training to complete and mount output model to workspace. Thank you for watching.